Here's how to cut a jalapeno. Now a jalapeno, of course, is a chili pepper, so it's spicy, it's got spicy oils in there. You can wear gloves if you don't want to touch it with your bare hands, but if you are like me and you cut it with your bare hands, just remember to wash your hands after you're handling it and don't stick your finger in your eye. In fact, you should never stick your finger in your eye. If your jalapeno is nice and straight like this one, here's how I like to cut it. I cut just the side of the jalapeno off. Then I rotate it and cut the next side off and rotate it again and continue doing this all the way around the jalapeno pepper. And what I end up with is all the seeds in the center and not on my cutting board. Now it's the seeds where most of that heat resides. So if you like spice, go ahead and use some of the seeds. If you don't, you can just discard that. Now you have your beautiful pepper strips. You can go ahead and slice it into thin slices Generally, with jalapeno pepper, you do slice them quite small because, of course, it's spicy. Nobody wants a big chunk of something spicy in their mouth. Once you have all your nice thin strips, turn them on their side together, and then you can just rock your knife through the jalapeno, getting nice, fine dice. Now, if your jalapeno pepper happens to be curvy, like this stereotypically shaped jalapeno pepper, it's hard to cut the sides off. So the best way to tackle it is this way. Take that jalapeno pepper and slice it right in half, all the way through that stem cavity. Now you'll see the seed packet has been disturbed. So you can take your paring knife and go ahead and slice the veins of that pepper, trying to capture all the seeds in the center and go around the stem area. Then you can just pull that seed packet away and get rid of that, unless you like spice. In which case, throw the seeds in as well. Scrape any excess seeds out of the center of the pepper and discard those. Then you can go ahead and slice the pepper in the exact same way, making nice thin slices, and then dice them into little tiny mints. That's how you cut a jalapeno pepper. Wash your hands, don't stick your finger in your eye.